Uh, that's what we're going to do a lesson on. So we have a collection of 251 things that we had on sale. And uh, it's all tons of 251 lines. And I was going to feature a couple in minors. All right, let's take a look at this. Here's a cool little one. Uh, let's look at number one. Let's look at number one. And this is 2-5 in C minor since I've been doing so many C minor things. So it starts on D minor 7 flat 5. And then here's the line that we play. How do you want to finger it? You know what I'm saying? And then the next line is for the G, and we're going to go like this. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Don't do that. We're going to go E flat. So we're going to encase the fifth, and then we're going to go to the third. that so first we had and now for the C minor we're gonna go right up a, a C minor chord so So again, two, five, one in C minor, two chord, the five chord, the one chord. Okay, put them together. Okay, so you see that 2-5-1 in C minor, um, <clears throat> when, you, when you go to learn a lick, and this is really important, is to try to play it correctly right from the very beginning. And so what does that mean? It means play it like super slow, make sure you got the first note right, okay? The second note right, and which finger is it going to do it? Are you going to slide up like that? You're going to finger it like this. Slide up. And then a pull off. So just take little bits. The second half. Okay, you just take it super duper slow. Analyze each note, okay? You want to learn it almost to the point where you can write it out after a few times through, okay? So you got to take it super duper slow. And then you'll be good to go. Hey, that kind of rhymed, didn't it? So, um, very important, okay? We'll do one, another one later. Or, I don't know. Should we do another one now, Wes? What do you think? Do you have? If you have another one, yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, tell you what. From the collection of Jazz Licks, 251 Jazz Licks, this one is minor. Let's do A minor 7, D7, G minor. So we have... So let's take a look at this one. For the A minor chord, 
we're going like this. I'm starting on the note G, and you might look at it maybe A minor is the same, same as G mi uh, C minor six. So you might go the second note, and then I'm going to slide down, and then there's the first four notes. Okay. Next, we're going to go to the root. So now I have, sounds like a nursery rhyme. Okay, now, there it is. Now the next line is going to be first finger coming down, and then the tritone. There's the first four notes. So let's try it. Now I'm gonna slide this note up to the third of D7, to the sharp five, to the flat seven. So for the D7, it's... Isn't that pretty? And now for the G minor, we're going to go, all right, minor third, root, and then we're going to refer back to the dominant chord, D7, and then come back and hit, and then we're going to refer back to, or let's play that down here, tell you what, so we go, this is what I mean by playing something correctly from the beginning, because now I played that note there, I should have played it here. So I gave my mind the wrong information. Okay, from the D7, listen. And now we're going to end it with now a reference to C minor. And then a D augmented chord. Here's the last line. So put it together. Okay, so learning looks like that really important, and uh, you're going to get a lot from it. So if you like this, go and go and get that uh, collection of them. Keep you busy, like Wes said, for a long, long time. Hi, Rich here again. I just wanted to say thanks for checking out my videos. If you like it, hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and sign up for those notifications so you can see all the cool guitar videos we put out each week. If you want more lessons right now, I have hundreds of them at guitarcollegelibrary.com. Check out our low price monthly streaming memberships. And if you want to learn jazz, check out my course, Jazz Guitar Improv. I take beginner jazz players and get them playing awesome solos on the fly. You'll see the link for the JGI course in the description below. Hey, thanks again for watching my channel. We'll see you again real soon with a new video.